became a doctor through the support of this woman and uh, he ensured and he tried as his best obviously that we, we became doctors too i'm the youngest doctor in my family and all my senior siblings up, upwards they're all doctors so i'm lucky to be a doctor too i will have become something else but i thank god for that and his legacy and my joy is that we carry on the things that this woman this american missionary wanted and also to carry on my father's business as well and to carry on his legacy to provide affordable health care to people in nigeria if possible by the grace of god that is why through atg through our mission in atg i've decided that people obviously need opportunity to get pregnant that's why we focus most importantly on getting pregnant and asking gynecologists and we focus on infertility and by the grace of god we've been given the grace to hard to families and people are changing and lives are changing don't worry leave your questions till the end i will answer our questions by the grace of god so don't just hold on because if you put your questions now i'll probably miss your questions so i'm going to answer everything tonight I'll, first of all i'll first of all answer questions after answering questions i will now explain to you how you can get sorted and get booked for to, for ivf at the atg ivf center so listen so that's how i became a doctor uh, I, I, I i was lucky and but despite that i want to ensure that the luck i have i want to use to improve lives i love working hard and i love to give people value i love to make a change i want to ensure that people are loved and they're given what they want if they can everything we have in this world we brought nothing everything stays here and when we live here we leave everything behind no matter how rich no matter how poor you are whatever you have you're going to leave it behind you cannot take anything out of this globe you will only live as you came okay our life consists of only our breath once the breath leaves the body the body is just as good as a chemical composition of matter but our life that air we breathe in and out is what is the most important and the most valuable to us so which more use our breath to glorify god to thank god in everything we do you don't have to be a pastor or a, a, a an, an imam to add value to people whatever you're doing even if you're a bread seller you're a baker you're, you're you're selling on the high street you're selling in the market whatever you do you are doing the work of god so put in your best in everything you do put hello my can see my niece she's already here as well hello i won't mention her name but she knows what i'm talking about i can see my niece is already on she's on instagram and she's here giving me uh, uh thumbs up so thank you my wonderful niece and she's my first beautiful she's a doctor doctor in the making thank you my lovely darling daughter i can see you there i won't mention your name but you know yourself anyway this opportunity that i had and that i have is that i want to add something of value to people by doing that after i'm gone by the grace of god i'll be able to look back and say this and this and this came through my effort not to glorify anything but to glorify god whatever we do must be done for one thing to the glory of god so whatever you do whether you're a doctor you're a nurse you're a pastor you're a teacher you're a judge you're a market seller you're a bus driver you're a plumber artisan electrician bricklayer anything you do be to the glory of god by doing it to the glory of god and putting your best in whatever you do you'll be, be you'll be adding value to this world and trust me you'll be a miracle worker one way or the other that is my purpose in atg that's what i'm here for without much ado let's start taking questions quickly and then i'll talk about how the atg ivf center works i'm going to use this board behind me to explain things to you so please listen there's a question here on instagram by jimmy hendrix what is your question Please text in your question. Let us see. Can the clerk is asking here? Good evening. How many envoys can you transfer at once? We try as much as possible not to go beyond two. In most cases at ATGIDF Center, we'll try to do one. But you can also give two as well. We we'll try and transfer not more than two embryos because putting more than two embryos increases the risks of many problems and many pregnancy complications, including diabetes in pregnancy, blood pressure in pregnancy, risk of stillbirth, risk of miscarriage, and all and so on and so forth. So we we'll try and put not more than two maximum on as much as we can. Jimmy Andrews is asking your Instagram: Can I get pregnant if I had sex during my period? You use the condom you also did pull out method you can get pregnant okay but it's very unlikely if you have sex during your period 
is very unlikely to get pregnant but it's still possible to, 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 it's still possible because anything is possible but theoretically you will not get pregnant if you have sex during your period but first of all i'm going to ask why do you want to have sex during your period if it's okay for you fine to me it sounds a bit mercy but if it's okay for you to have sex during your period by all means do that but to get pregnant during your period is very 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 unlikely okay thank you uh, someone is asking a question do you also do IUI? Yes. Don't worry. I'll answer all the questions tonight about what we do at ATGIVF Center so you have an idea of what we do. So just stay tuned, okay? Chioma is asking, I have endometriosis. Can IVF be successful? Yes and no. It depends on how bad your endometriosis is and it depends on where the endometriosis is. If your endometriosis is already damaged and damaged your tubes, is damaged your ovaries, then IVF is likely unlikely to be successful. But if it's just minimal endometriosis, it's unlikely to affect. So it depends on the grade and the severity of your endometriosis. That will matter. Okay, Pauline Paul, welcome. Una Paul, uh, a Jumeta, welcome. Christina, thank you. So you can, for people that need the address of the of the uh, IVF center, you can see the address already here on, on Facebook from Christina. She's put the address of our center to you. Somebody's asking, how much is IVF? You're 35 years of age. Patients Obu, about IVF, cost and everything, I'll put it on this screen shortly, okay? So since people are asking for the IVF cost, let's start anyway. So, at the ATG IVF Center, I'll put it here, ATG IVF Center. Okay? Our plan is to ensure that we have and we create an affordable, You, my screen here will be upside down or reverse. Once we put it on, on YouTube, it will be perfectly the way you want it to be. But listen attentively, okay? People are asking for the cost of the ATG, IVF Center, IVF, IVF. So I'll put quickly answer that question, okay? So please stay tuned, okay? And then once you finish answering the question, I'll come back to answer other medical questions on the screen. At the ATG IVF Center, okay? At the center here, okay, is the IVF, okay? IVF is everything we do here is IVF, okay? And I already explained that we have we can do one cycle and two cycles. For those that attended the April seminar, for those that attended the April seminar, and for anybody that has used the ATG laboratory before for any test, if you've used our laboratory at ATG Center for any infertility test, if you've used ATG laboratory for any infertility test, and if you've attended the April 2021 seminar, and if you are a subscriber to our premium services, whatever it is, whether it's gold, diamond, platinum, you've subscribed to our premium services, you came for the seminar in April, you are expected to get a discount at the ATG IVF Center. You can ask for it. Even if you've paid up and you've saved already, before commencing your treatment, Give us the receipt of anything you've done with us, and we'll give you a discount of hundred thousand naira. Now listen. For ATG IVF Center, one cycle of IVF, which includes all your medications, which includes cost of anesthesia, cost of registration, cost of all the tests for the couples, man, woman, cost of um, coming to the hospital, your appointments, your nursing care. Everything, include your appointment, everything, you're going to pay 1.3 for one cycle. What is one cycle? One cycle means we give you medications to regulate your period, stimulate your ovaries, retrieve your eggs from your ovaries that is, that is responding, save the eggs in, in the incubator, get your husband's sperm, fertilize it, and put it back into you, transfer. Including all the tests you would do, your husband will do, which includes all these hormonal profile, retroviral screening, blood group, genotype, nursing care, anesthesia, all the medications you use for the IVF stimulation, everything is 1.3. If you came for our seminar in April, if you're a previous services subscriber, if you've used our lab before, I need IVF, we're going to take away 100k from discount, we'll give it to you. So you're going to pay 1.2. Instead of paying 1.3, you pay 1.2. No bargain. 1.3, you have discount 100. Some people will say, what if that one attempt fails? 
and I want to try again. Okay, we're going to bill you again 1.3. But to prevent that, because I know that sometimes IVF does not work in most cases for people, I want to ensure that people can get pregnant as smooth as possible. So therefore, we've come up with a plan that to say we can do two cycles. Okay, instead of paying two cycles for 2.6. You you pay only one point eight. You're saving a lot of money over eight hundred thousand naira. That cost is on us, and I'll bear that cost by God's grace. However, if you've attended our seminar in April, if you've attended our seminar in April, you're a premium services member. You've used our lab before at the ATG lab. We give you a discount of two hundred thousand. So you pay only one point six for two cycles. Somebody asked me, okay, doctor, what if I get pregnant with the first attempt? Will you give me back my 600 or give me back my leftover? No. What if you don't get pregnant? Won't we bear the cost? That, that's a bonanza. That's a discount for you. So if you get pregnant on the first attempt, but you're giving, so that extra money you pay for two cycles is an insurance for you. It's what? An insurance for you. So that money you paid extra, was and is is an insurance for you because if you didn't get pregnant now who pays that we will cover it but if you're not worried you want to do only one attempt go for the one but if you say okay let me be sure you can do the two for those that want to plan i want to come from london i want to come from abuja i want to travel from america i'm coming from Paracot. i'm coming from somewhere far away how much time should i plan to do my ivf one cycle one cycle will take you between five to six weeks but i'll tell people book five to seven weeks just in case book five to seven weeks so that you have all the time to get your you know your eggs i mean to get your cycle regulated we do the down regulation we get the eggs i take out the eggs incubate and fertilize incubate and put it back to you give us at least four and uh, five to six seven weeks to get all this done because sometimes along the line we might find some issues there. Don't forget that this cost of 1.3 million covers all your drugs, all your scans, all your appointments, all your reviews, and every care, after care, we give to you. Now, this is IVF. Okay? Now, IVF has other issues. Like somebody asked me a question. Doctor, do you do egg donor? Do you do IUI? Do you do this? Do you do donor egg? Here comes the answer. Because everything centers around IVF. That, I have to say that first. Now, if somebody comes to me and says, Doctor, I need donor egg. Okay? Donor egg. Fine. We have donors around. We have to pay those donors because they are all, all, all giving a service. We stimulate their eggs, collect their eggs. Okay? It's very uncomfortable for them. We have to pay them so that we can get eggs from them. And we use donors that will screen, check for diseases, and so that they are not, not bring any disease to you. So we screen the donors. All that, all those tests is going to be covered by us at the ATG IVF Center. All you need to do is that you pay something extra just to cover the donor egg. And for our donor eggs, per attempt, we charge 200K. We don't make profit on that because most of the money goes to the donor, the ladies. And we ensure that the ladies that we bring, they are very, very young. Their eggs are very, very good and they are promising for success so that we increase and improve your success chances and even our success rate. For those that say, okay, fine, you know, I'm okay with my egg, but my husband has no sperm. My husband has isospermia. No sperm at all. We have donor sperm available too. And that's even cheaper. Donor sperm is about 100k. We have to pay them too because it obviously uh, is it, donation is by convenience though we have to pay the people that donate and before they donate to even to you we screen them we do tests for them so that they're not bringing any stupid diseases to you okay we screen them including hiv test hepatitis b hepatitis c and all that all those tests we do are also covered in your 1.3 but if you're bringing a donor we have to cover them because we're going to do all these tests all, all those screens for you and your husband that is in this one, but for an, an for a donor, we have to cover them separately. That come, comes here. Somebody say, okay, doctor, I need to okay. We don't have any egg, we don't have any sperm, but we want to collect the two. So that is donor embryo. We have it here. Donor embryo. Okay, and that one, that one 
is straightforward. It costs more, but we cover it at 450. Okay, because the donut embryo, we board, we get the egg donor, we get the sperm donor, we have to mix it in the laboratory and ensure that they are well caught before we put it back. That's why the donor embryo is slightly more than these two. Embryo is a mixture of sperm and egg. It cannot be equal like this because we have to use other things to ensure that the embryo and the egg, the embryo, the egg and the sperm are compatible and they work and they fertilize before we give it to you. Some will waste along the line. So we have to cover that. Okay. Per attempt, donor embryo is 450. Some people say, okay, okay, doctor, I want to come to Nigeria. Mm -hmm. My husband will come with me. But my husband cannot stay for more than a week. I can stay for up to five to six weeks. But he has to go back to work. We are we, 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 we got you covered. Because I know that I cannot keep the husband and wife together together in Lagos. They have to work in abroad. Abroad, abroad we pay for everything. Mortgage, light, everything. Every month. So they can't be dull. Moment. So if you come with your husband to Nigeria and you get all these tests done, your husband can go back to, uh, to the abroad, to Italy, to Europe, to Germany, to London, to Canada, to America. We can collect his sperm and freeze it for you. We can collect and freeze it for you. We call it sperm freezing, egg freezing, or embryo freezing. We have uh, tallies for that. They are separate. See, all these things are separate outside IVF. That's why I put the IVF in the center and put all these other costs outside. So if you want to freeze, okay, he has to go back, or I have to go back. Free, freeze it for me. I'll come back later. We can freeze the sperm. We can freeze the egg. We can freeze the embryo. Okay? To freeze the embryo is 400. To freeze the sperm and the egg, each of them is 200. Okay. So, somebody is okay, doctor. I want to be sure that I have a particular gender I want. I want a boy only. In most places in the world, it's not as affordable. But in the ATGIVF center, the professionals there, they can help with gender selection. Okay? We talk to us. Somebody say, fine, you know, my husband, he has sperm, but he can't produce his sperm because there's blockage, all those damages. Don't worry. We can go, we can go and aspirate the sperm from the testicles. We have surgical sperm retrieval. Surgical sperm retrieval okay so a surgical sperm collection we're going we can aspirate the egg uh, the sperm and we get the best sperm we look at it under microscope that this is the best sperm we put it in your egg get you pregnant we have the surgical sperm retrieval surgical sperm collection some people too the sperm the sperm of the man is not good so we have to go in critically to search under electron microscope to pick this best sperm from what they've released. ICSI is a bit expensive, but we do it at ATG Laboratories. So all this is come separate cost on top of the IVF. Okay? But if you've come to ATGs before, you're a previous services member, you're a gold member, diamond member, platinum member, you've been at a seminar in April, you get a discount. And for you that want to hear as well, I'll give you a trick. There's a seminar coming up in May as well. Okay? For those that attend, I'm, I have a special gift for them. I love giving gifts because gifts are meant to be. If you attend the seminar coming up in May, there's a gift for you. I won't tell you that. Just keep attention. Are you following me? That is for the ATG IVF, IVF, IVF um, center. Now, I'll take some questions now because people are asking questions on the screen. I can see here. Good. Um, so, let's come back to um, ATG. Taiwo JP is asking, can IVF be performed with this result? Don't put your result on the screen. Don't put your husband's result on the screen. If you want to ask questions one-on-one, -on -one, talk to me at the premium services. This thing on this Facebook, everybody is seeing your story. Don't put your stuff on the screen. Don't put your husband's result on the screen. Don't put your result on the screen. Send it privately. Let us deal with it. What age is IVF? There's no age that we don't do IVF. Okay? But obviously, some age, some, age, some particular age, the IVF is not safe. When you come to us, we'll advise you on that. Okay? 
we'll look at your story we'll look at your details and then we'll talk to you about that okay all right thank you vivian thank you go thank you christina thank you uh christina thank you so for lack mc when you contact us come to the center you can we we'll talk about the age about ivf now if you want to book for your ivf just call our laboratories call the atg ivf center call nike my our, our atg lab manager and she'll go through these details with you and get you on board you can open an account with her at the atg center and you can start to deposit your money so that you don't be in the back queue once we open somebody is saying that she's been taking bomocryptine since november last year it finished last week you missed your period this month you did the test of pregnancy it came back negative what is the issue the issue could be that you're taking bomocryptine and you don't even know what you're doing some people will take bomocryptine and they don't even know about their prolactin somebody will say because i saw breast in my in my so i saw milk on my breast that's why i took bomocryptine a friend told me to take bomocryptine first of all before you take bomocryptine for polar i i prolactin well, how did you know it's high prolactin that means that you must do a prolactin test and that test will say that your prolactin is high you will not start you on the mi mi minimum dose of prolactin after taking the, the, the uh, after taking the bomocryptine for at least four to five weeks we should check your prolactin level to see if it's responding some people they'll be on bomocryptine they will never take their prolactin they just be taking it every day every day every day every day and they will assume that by some magic by some prayer by some magic that their prolactin will go down who told you so your prolactin will respond to the dose of your bomocryptine so if you're going to take bomocryptine first of all there must be an initial test a baseline test so we know what level your bomocryp your prolactin was before we started treatment so once you start taking the medication we check your level again four to five weeks to see if it's coming down if it's not coming down we might need to change the medication or add something else or change it entirely so all this you must understand or even increase the dose so you must factor this in before you start swallowing bubocryptine the general selection go to ATGIVF for general selection thank you Christina so there's a question here Mm. Uh, how much is IVF for twin? There's no separate price for IVF for twin. If we get one good embryo, we put it there. If we get more than one, and you want to put two there, we we'll put it in for you. There's no extra cost for that. If you be to other places and they charge you extra for that, we don't do that in ATG. If you want two, and there are two very good ones, and your health is not going to be at risk, you're not going to die. You know, your, your health is not at risk for two. We did there. But if your health is going to be at risk, we don't want to put it on. Mm -hmm. Very good. Thank you, Agu Chioma, for the general selection, ATGIVF. For the foundation, the foundation, we are still waiting for people, people to do, donate money. But yet, they're not yet donated money. So once we start the IVF section, and uh, we encourage people to donate, and once people donate for people, we extend it to people that need for now we've not seen anybody to donate nobody has donated but if you have it in your heart and you're watching me i want to donate for the atg foundation to assist other people to get pregnant you're free to call our laboratories and to donate money for people so that they can get ivf done if you're blessed with extra and you want to donate for to donate to people to do ivf you can call the laboratory and tell nikki that you want to donate and then she will take donations and we can use it to help people that need ivf okay and once we have anybody we will send you a letter so you know what you've used your money for is it normal to have delayed period my period is two days late two days late is not a big deal now your period is not going to be exact one or two one day or two days so your period could, could be a day late or a day earlier a day or two is not a big deal don't take a day or two late for a period to be a big big deal your period is not going to be bang on 28 days every month there will be some slight variation a day or two allow that that is normal and if you've done your test of pregnancy and it's negative then you're not pregnant you're on the stone to treat lithium phase defects how many months is enough if your doctor is monitoring you for taking the stone for lithium phase deficiency deficiency should be seeing you within four or five weeks okay egg donor is how much egg donor is uh 200k can purging be a sign of pregnancy purging uh, loose tool or purging is not a sign of pregnancy. Yo. If you are purging, probably you had something that is nasty. Go get checked. 
ATG IVF is in Lagos. ATG IVF is in Lagos. We are, no, we are not in anywhere else in Nigeria except Lagos. For those that need IVF outside Lagos, you can always come to Lagos if you want, or we can give you a referral to a different center. One of my colleagues outside Lagos, but I have no power over Python there. It's just a colleague to colleague referral. Can let us delay period? Yes. Let us and delay period, but it doesn't cause UTI. Doctor, is it medically possible for someone who has no follicles to produce egg? It's difficult, unlikely. Any question here on Instagram? Is it advisable for a 32 year old to do IVF after? Yes. If you are 32 year old, you have un you have unexplained infertility. You can do IVF. Okay, you have unexplained infertility. 32 year old, you can do IVF. If someone, if one had miscarriages and her vagina is is hot inside, can you do IVF? <laughs> Your vagina is hot inside. I don't know what I what what, what temperature there that is hot. Is, is it boiling water? How can vagina be hot inside? Except you have infection. Vagina cannot be hot inside though. I don't know how people say it though. Vagina is warm because you're a warm-blooded human being. You are a warm-blooded human being. Vagina is not hot from being warm-blooded. If your vagina is warm, it's normal. Eh? Your vag vagina is in the center of your body. It will, be it will be warm now. So it's normal for vagina to be warm. And that does not, that does not cause miscarriages, okay? Doctor, when, when I sleep, my husband's sperm pour out. I've never seen a woman that sperm will not pour out of a vagina after sex. I've, except that woman is an alien. And that person walks on her head. As far as you're a human being and you walk with your legs, okay? As far as you're a human being and you walk with your legs, once you get up or you sleep, sperm will pour out of your vagina. Except you want to lock and tie your vagina. Sperm will pour out. The only thing that your sperm, that the husband put into you, is it of good quality? If the sperm is good quality, it won't stop you from getting pregnant. Can fibroids affect IVF? Very unlikely. Except the fibroid is in the womb cavity, or is multiple fibroids that is distorting the womb cavity. It can, it can affect and cause infertility. We are in Lagos. The address is already on the screen. We are in the Limonshaw area of Lagos State. And once you get to the Limonshaw, you see a name. Bold written on the expressway. ATG IVF Center. Doctor, you have a 3 centimeter cyst on Instagram here. Causing you to have mouth pain. Should you be worried? No. If your 3 centimeter cyst is a simple cyst. Yeah, no need to be worried. If your three centimeter cyst is a simple cyst, no need to be worried. But I'll suggest you get a scan again done in three to four months' time to see if the cyst is getting bigger or not. Somebody asked me a question about IUI. I forgot that. Let's put IUI here. IUI is used in infertility for people that are. In fact, I didn't put IUI because IUI is not really under IVF. So let me um, clean this up. Excuse me, I'm looking for my duster here. So I'll take off IUI. I didn't put IUI here because IUI is really not part of IVF. Okay, so this is IVF completed here. Now, IUI is a separate thing, it's called intrauterine insemination. What it means is that, oh, um, so we have it here IUI. We do IUI too at the ATG IVF center. Yes, IUI. We do it there, we do it there, we do it there, we do it there. So we do IUI there, intrauterine insemination. Nation. Basically, is when the, span, the, the man has the problem. And the man, maybe whenever he ejaculates, it pours out because this, this penis has, 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 has an abnormality. So the person cannot even dump any sperm at all in the vagina. Everything, because some people, their, their penis, instead of opening at the tip, it opens underneath. So their penis has, has, has an abnormal shape. They cannot even enter into their wife. Okay? So what we do is that we allow, allow them to produce sperm. We take it and go and put it in. As for such people, we let the woman ovulate naturally. We take over and we program their ovulation, their cycle. And once we know that they are, they are ovulating, we call them in, get the sperm from the man. I know the woman is ovulating. She's released egg. I put the sperm inside and God will do the rest. Okay? So, IUI is not really IVF. It's a simple process on its own. So, it's not under the IVF list. But IUI, one cycle is 400 grand. At ATG IVF Center, four four hundred, everything four hundred. All the tests you would do, test your wife would do, all the collection and 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 putting it back in four hundred. Okay, and if you be at the ATG ATG Center at the premium services, you've done any of your tests in ATG, we'll give you a discount. You won't pay four hundred, you pay less than that. Okay. 
can my IVF be successful when I have ovarian cyst, PCOS? Yes. Can in intracavities, myoma, cause infertility? Yes. If you have fibroids in your womb, it can cause infertility. Question here on question here on Instagram. I can see Awele Johnson on Instagram. Thank you so much, Awele Johnson on Instagram. I wave at you. Thank you, uh, Gold Diva. Thank you, uh, all these wonderful people on Instagram. I can't read names properly here. Messy Steve. Uh, thank you, guys. Somebody say says is FSH constant. I didn't see my period for three months. If you haven't seen your period for three months, go and do your hormonal profile. No period for three months, go and do your hormonal profile. Doctor, can you get me connected with any center in Enugu? Yes. Just go to the period services, ATG referral. I'll get the a referral to you to see somebody in Enugu if you want, okay? Can IVF procedure be successful? Yes, I've already answered that question. Thank you so much. Uh, let's check on another question here on Instagram. What is the chance of pregnancy after IVF for unexplained infertility? Almost 60% positive to 80%. Okay. Can infection delay pregnancy? If you have an infection that has damaged you and blocked your tubes, you can delay pregnancy. Can I start IVF procedure after with all business? Yes. You can start IVF procedure in ATG laboratories from July this year. From June this year, sorry. Can 35-year-old lady do IVF after one year of fibroid operation? Yes. Uh, yes, thank you. Thank you, Julia. Thank you, Umbono Loveling. How much is IVF? We just explained it here, the cost of IVF. I've explained it here. If you don't catch it up here, just call the uh, the, IV, the IVF laboratory tomorrow and la la Secretary Nikkei will explain to you all the prices again. Okay? Or you can watch this video on Facebook again all over, all over, all over again. Umbono Loveling, you can start IVF at the ATG Center in june 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 what is the total of test and ivf 1.3 million if you've used our lab before you've attended our seminar in april you get it for 1.2 okay ivf one cycle 1.2 ivf one cycle 1.2 that is to say you're using your own eggs using your husband's sperm you're not using any other thing okay you're not borrowing egg you're not borrowing sperm you're not freezing egg you're not doing XC. You know, everything is okay. It's just the egg and the sperm. We, jo we join together and put into you IVF simple. 1.2, 1.3. Or 1.2 if you are a member of ATG Premium Services or you use that lab before or you are the April seminar. 1.2. If you've not used any services before, 1.3. How do I know my, my body's okay? How do I know my body's okay for IVF? How do you know? We'll do all the tests. Okay, we'll do all the tests. If you want to know if your body is okay for IVF before coming to our IVF, you can do go to the ATG laboratories and do all your hormonal profile at the ATG laboratories. Okay? And then you can know if your body is okay for IVF if you want to do that. But before you start your journey IVF, IVF journey, we'll do all the tests for you anyway at the IVF laboratory. But if you want to say, okay, I want to know my body is okay. I want to do my, all the tests for fertility. You can do all your hormonal profile at the ATG laboratories. Okay? Thank you. You have chronic pain, uh, chronic pile. Chronic pile does not cause infertility. Chronic pile does not cause infertility. Uh, let's see a question here on Instagram. Good. Instagram, Instagram, Instagram. Okay, Instagram, where are you? Okay, good. We're here back again to a ATG Facebook. Are first circuit IVF always successful? Not always. I will lay. I will lay. I will IVF always successful in first attempt? Not, not, not always. About sixty percent. That is why, as an insurance, instead of, instead of paying one cycle, you can pay two cycles with one point eight. Instead of, instead of paying one cycle, one point three times two twice, make it two point six. You can just go for two cycles, pay for that one point eight. So you paid extra five hundred as an insurance. The other cost I will bear. ATG will bear for you. So if to cover that risk of failure, you can do 1.8. Oseni Akim, do we have a center in Ikorodu? Our center is in Lagos and Alimosho. Ikorodu is in Lagos. Alimosho is in Lagos. My sister, if you want to get pregnant, some people are traveling from London, from Abuja, 
from uh, Lagos Island to Yalimosho, you are in Ikorodu. Don't let your faith delay you. Uh -huh. You ask him whether we have in Ikorodu. We are already in Lagos. Someone, somebody is, uh, is in Abuja is coming down. You in Lagos, you already complained that you're in Ikorodu. You better walk in and walk and start walking from today. You get there tomorrow. Thank you. How much is your IVF and egg and sperm donor? We have it here. IVF is 1.3 for one cycle. We have the egg donor 200, sperm donor 100. If you want uh, uh, donor, donor uh, uh, embryo for 450, donor embryo, we put it together, set, put it into you. The donor egg, donor sperm, there's a risk of failure there. To remove that other risk of failure, put it separately, we put it one go, ma'am, 450. On top of the 1.3, separate cost. Is the area safe? At, if you are, you, are, you, are, you are 34 weeks, is the area safe? The area is not safe any, at any time. If you're having diarrhea, you, you can't keep any, you're always stolen water. Not it's not safe whether you're pregnant or not. No diarrhea is safe for anybody at any time. Get treated. What infection will block your tubes? Chlamydia will block your tubes. Gonorrhea will block your tubes. Chlamydia, gonorrhea will block tubes. So if you have chlamydia, treat it. You have gonorrhea, treat it. They will damage tubes. Direct me to any clinic by you where IVF can be done in worry. That's fine. Get a glory. Just subscribe to the ATG payment services. I'll forward address to you. Same thing in Calabar. If you get you want in Calabar, no problem. Just join the people, premium, premium, premium services. I'll forward to you for Calabar. Okay. If my body is not really okay for IVF at the moment, hope it can be taken care of by ATG before IVF procedure. Yes, definitely. We can see you and get your body okay for IVF by doing all your monal profile. By doing your ultrasound scan and checking that your body is well, ready, and set for IVF, okay? How can someone, how should, so, how should ovulation be, how should ovulation be to know you're fertile? I don't know. If you're ovulating, you're ovulating. As far as there's no blockage in your tubes, your husband's sperm is good, you're fertile. You're ovulating, you've done day 21 progesterone, it's okay that you're ovulating. You have a regular period, your eggs is coming out, there's no blockage in your tubes, you're fatal. To know whether you're fatal, do your HSG, do your FSH hormone, do your the 21 progesterone, and that will let me know if you're ovulating. That's all. Some people will say, I'm waiting for egg white to know I'm ovulating. My sister, don't be like the stupid virgins. Don't wait to see egg white to ovulate. I don't know who, which doctor told you to wait for egg white to know you're ovulating. If you are having regular periods, 80 to 95% of the time you're having ovulation. Most people having regular periods are ovulating. Most people having regular periods are ovulating, almost 85%, 90%. Okay? Nobody must see egg white to confirm that they are ovulating or not. Don't wait for egg white to know that you're ovulating. Do not wait for egg white to know you're ovulating. Okay? I've seen people where they don't see egg white and they're ovulating. I've seen people that have egg white and they are not ovulating. Okay? All right. Lovely Mbonu will fix you and get your body ready for IVF. Okay? God bless you. Don't be a dad in Thomas. Take the next step. Please explain more on the cycle. Can one cycle give twins? It's possible. For one cycle, if you got one very good embryo, we put it there. If you got two good embryos, we put it there. Some people, you put only one embryo. It, it, you divide it into two. That one is God. So one cycle can give you twins. It's possible. But if that one cycle fails, you have another second attempt for you if you pay the 1.8 to get that two attempts. In fact, the people that have paid, 10 people have already paid. They've already put their money installment waiting for us to open in June. And they paid for the two cycles. Because they know from experience. Maybe, maybe they've done it before somewhere else. And they failed. And they've spent close to so much money somewhere else. And they know that they can fail. And our bonanza money here is reasonably priced for them for two solid cycles. Why wouldn't they take advantage of that? If you go and price this kind of IVF on, on the island, people pay premium for it. So why don't you take advantage of the bonanza as these 10 people, as these 10 virgins 
have taken advantage of it. Don't be the slow va or the late virgin. In case my husband has low sperm count, 3 million, can TTC use pussy to conceive? Pussy might help. Okay? But if you are, your husband has 3 million sperm, it's very low, and you've done it before for a year or two, it's not happening, then let come and do IUI for 400 at ATG Laboratory. For the IUI, your sperm of 3 million is going to be useful as far as you're ovulating. And you're not going to take donor egg. If you're going to do IUI, and you're going to use donor egg or donor sperm, then we're going for IUI, IVF then. Okay? So IUI is when the man has the problem, but you're ovulating. Your tubes are not blocked. You can, you're able to get your egg into your womb yourself. IUI is going, God's going to take your husband's sperm and put it in sterile condition. All, all, all conditions ticked and met. Get pregnant. 3 million sperm can get you pregnant at IUI. Okay? Can someone with blood pressure go for IVF? Yeah. If you have blood pressure, you can do IVF with us. But if you have blood pressure problems, we'll probably put in only one. The reason is putting two is going to increase your blood pressure problems more and cause you miscarriage. So if you got blood pressure, we keep it under control. But we usually transfer only one for people that have other medical problems like diabetes, blood pressure, and so on and so forth. How much is IVF? 1.3. You get to pay 1.2 if you've attended our seminars in April, you're a pre you're a pre services member, or if you've used our laboratories before for any infertility test. Doctor, can I choose my gender at IVF? Yes. I already answered that question. You can choose your gender there. So, Mbono Lovely, you can choose your gender at, this, at the IVF center, okay? Can IVF be successful with 8.7 fibroid? If you got a huge fibroid distorting your womb cavity, we should remove the fibroid first, Taiwo, before going for IVF. <laughs> the fibroid will increase the risk of loss. How much is two cycles of IVF? You got it here, 1.8. If you're a member of ATG services, you've used a lab before, you had a seminar in April, you pay 1.6. Okay? Hello, my sister, how are you? I can see your large room or cabin bala or keola. I will igwe. What is secondary infertility? Secondary infertility is if you've been able to get pregnant before, but this time around you haven't challenges getting pregnant. Secondary infertility is if you've been pregnant before, but now you have challenges getting pregnant. That's secondary infertility. Can a young woman of 33 FSH do IVF with her egg? If you're a young woman and your FSH is 33, 33, and it's same 33 on two occasions apart. It's likely that you're not ovulating anymore. And if you're not ovulating anymore, that means you're not producing an egg. That means we got, we got to use egg donor for you. If you're producing egg, you're ovulating, you're producing egg, your FSH will not be 33. It will be less than 30. Okay? Can someone that goes with low sperm count after doctor medication, something, something, if you have low sperm count, you can do IVF, you can do IUI. Umbono Lovelin, you're asking so many questions. Umbono Lovelin, don't be selfish. Let other people ask questions. Umbono Lovelin, I've asked you about three times now. You're asking too much. Let other people ask questions too. You're not the only one here. I'm going to answer this question for you for the last time. Umbono Lovelin, can I choose the number of babies you want an IVF twin or triplet? Yes, but we can't put more than two. We will not put three there at ATG. Okay? At ATG Center, we'll not put two, uh, three. We'll put only two. And we'll put only two if your body is safe to put two. Okay? We'll put only one in most cases. But if your body is safe for two by doing all the tests and your body is safe to take two, we'll put two. Case closed. We don't put three. I'm going to love them. Let other people ask questions. Otherwise, I'll block you. I don't like people being uh, funny. I like people being considerate. <laughs> yes. Uh, doctor, can someone with at the age of 50 with a regular cycle get pregnant naturally? Yes, I didn't care, Gunjimi. If you're 50, you have a regular cycle and you're ovulating, you can get pregnant naturally. You can. But you go, you gotta be trying. On Instagram here, what is the success rate of IVF at 43? It's very low. About 1 to 2%. But if we use good donor eggs for you at 43, Success rate is going to be much, much better. But 
it's not going to be more than five percent of the thirty, to be honest. But in some cases, it's as high as ten to fifteen percent. Apart from infection, what else can cause mainly discharge during period? It's infection. Nothing else. Nothing else will cause many discharge. It's just it's infection. What else? It's just infection. What can cause smelly discharge apart from infection? Infection. Using donor egg, will the child be the woman's blood? If you use donor egg, the child will not be your genetic... Uh, we won't have any genetic link with you. But let me tell you something. If you're not able to get pregnant yourself and you need donor egg, the donor egg you've taken, nobody knows the donor egg. It's anonymous. The person is gone to their own life. What is most important is that that child you have, whether it's your blood or not, are you able to show love to that child? That's all. If you're not able to show love to any baby that you can bond yourself or to someone's donor egg, then don't start having babies. If you're not ready to show love to a child that you bond, that is genetically your similar that is genetically similar to you that is your blood if you can't show love to your baby from you your blood or you can't show baby to love to a baby that is born to a donor don't start having babies if you're not ready to show love to that baby you're going to conceive to uh, egg donor leave them alone in their in, in with baba god don't bring them to this world but for you to take that step that means that you're matured enough to look after a baby you might have enough to be a parent. If you can't show love to a child you're going to carry, or they will carry for you as surrogate, then you're not ready. At the ADG Center too, we have services available for surrogacy too. For people that can't carry their pregnancy, that they can't carry their own pregnancy, we have people available to be surrogates for you with all the legal people work done. How can I start saving for my IVF with ATG? Just call the center tomorrow. This queen has given you the email. Send an email to that center and say, I want to start my saving with the ATG IVF center. And Nikke will contact you tonight. Worst case scenario, she'll be on the phone to you 8.30 tomorrow morning. She'll give you her number and you can call her and you can talk to Nikke. She's lab manager. Okay? Thank you, princess. Yemi Bekis, God bless you, my wonderful nurse. Yemi Bekis, thank you so much. I can see you on, on Facebook here. God bless you. I can see your fingerprint. Thank you so much. You're a wonderful lady. You're, you're loved. We love you here. Yeah. At 50 years old, can you do IVF? Yes. Does the IVF include medication? Yes. The price of IVF was 1.3, 1.2 for, for people that are members. They covers all your medication, all your tests, all the nursing care, all the appointments, all the screening. Yes, it covers. Someone is asking, if the first one fails, can you provide reason and prevent the second one from failing? If the first one fails, we will try and provide reasons. But not all the time you can get a reason. Because sometimes, some things are totally beyond and way out of our hands. But we try our best to ensure that the first one works. But if it doesn't work, we have, we have the second attempt to give to you at the discount level to ensure that we've covered everything we can. Can someone with blocked tube see egg white? Yes. If you have blocked tubes, you can see egg white. But like I said all the time, I have been preaching with all my veins popping and busting. You don't have to see egg white to get pregnant. Can someone age 50 irregular period do IVF? Yes. Age 50 irregular period, you can do IVF. Thank you so much, my sister. Um, uh, Ude Enedema Loveth. Good evening. What is normal rate for FSH and FLH? As far as your FSH is less than 30, your FSH is less than 10. In most cases, I want your FSH and LH to be less than 10. Or about 10, thereabouts. Once they are less than 10, both of them, I'm happy. But your FSH must never be over 30. What causes pain in the stomach? Ulcer, ovarian cyst, fibroid, urine infection. All those things can cause pain. It can cause pain in your stomach. Can someone at 47 ovulate? It's possible. Anybody at 47 can ovulate. 
I've seen people at 50 getting pregnant naturally. Doctor, how many milligrams of folic acid should a woman of 31 take to get pregnant? You can take 400 micrograms to get pregnant, 31, okay? But if you have family risk, family history of neural tube defect, you've had a baby before with neural tube defect, you have blood pressure, you're obese, and so on and so forth, you should be on 5 milligrams. A situation after men's sperm cells are both 93 meals. His wife, womb, and eggs are okay. Plenty. Can they have baby normally after years of delay? Yes. As far as the tubes are not blocked, they can get pregnant. That's a blessing, Holland. Okay? Thank you, people on Instagram here. Today is the biggest day we've had Instagram viewers, and I'm loving it. And I can see Royal Infinity Palmer. She's asking, what is the price of surrogacy? For surrogacy, we don't have a fixed price because it depends on so many factors. So, for surrogacy, we'll get this surrogate for you. We'll uh, bring you together and two of you will negotiate yourself. Okay? For surrogacy, we don't have the... Because it's not fixed because it all depends on so many factors. So, we'll, we'll bring the surrogate with, we, to you. We arrange an appointment. Two of you discuss together because the surrogate sur 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 will carry your baby for you. So, you need to meet the person and then take it from there. Okay, but for some get it's your egg, it's your husband sperm. The person is just carrier for you. Okay, and that's how we get baby has no genetic link in most cases to your surrogate. Good evening, good evening, good evening. Okay, yeah. After IVF, child is born. Can the person son conceive naturally? If you conceive to IVF and you give birth to a girl or a boy, that boy or girl that you conceived can give birth and can father a child or a girl in future or a son in future any child born through ivf has not got any problem or any issue or any handicap from fathering a girl or a boy or any child he or she wants later okay doctor what causes delay on pregnancy when both partner are okay sometimes we don't know and where i'm suzette sometimes we call it unexplained cause of infertility the husband is okay the sperm is okay everything is okay but they can't get pregnant is unexplained cause of infertility for such people if they're trying for pregnancy for more than two years once it's more than one year and get it to 18 months start doing tests to know why how much is adotubation i don't know we don't do adotubation at the att center here okay adotubation i don't know the cost if you need it i'll send it to where you can get it done but in most cases once a tube is blocked adotubation does not work that is why we don't deal with that in ATG center here. Once the tubes are blocked, adotubation does not work. It only works in 25% of people. So I don't deal with adotubation. In fact, I don't believe in it. Once the tube has been blocked, it's been damaged. A damaged tube is not going to be good. It's going to increase the risk of ectopic pregnancy. After IVF, Ukaya have answered your question already. Ukaya Busari, have answered your question. A baby born through IVF does not have any problem in fathering another child. For example, if you have a child born through IVF, okay, that child can go and impregnate another girl once the person is old enough. Does that make sense? Can AS and AS go for IVF? Yes. But for IVF, A A A S and AS, they have a risk of excess. So what we do is that we have tests we can do to check the genotype before we put the embryo into you. We have tests we do so that we know what the genotype of the embryo is before we put the egg into you. Okay? Chicken now. Can one ovulate without signs of ovulation? I said it before. Again and again and again and again and again. You don't have to see egg white or all those funny, funny signs of ovulation to know that you're ovulating. If you're waiting for that to see any egg white, to see warm tummy, to see the mood changes, to know you're relating, you're wasting your death, you're wasting your lovely time. You don't have to see any of those stupid signs to know you're relating. If anybody told you otherwise, you're wrong. Okay, Ukaya, what's your question? Okay, if you got pregnant through IVF, there's possibility that you might need IVF again. Because that problem could still persist. If, on, on the other hand too, I've seen people that they got pregnant through IVF and later on, they were able to conceive on their own naturally without IVF. It's possible. 
Okay, I've seen people. Okay, is that your question? If it's your question, I'm answering it. If you got pregnant through IVF, there's a chance that you can fall pregnant on your own without IVF. But in most cases, people that did IVF, they probably need it again. What, what, what I've seen from experience is that people that get pregnant through IVF for unexplained infertility, they're able to get pregnant again on their own. Doctor, when can I come to for IVF in Lagos? From June will be open. Will be open from June. Mary J. Ashefo. What causes closed cervix? You've had a DNC before, infection before, you've had a treatment to your cervix from bad cancer cells, they can cause tight or closed cervix. Can one get pregnant during menstruation? That was the first question I answered today. I said it's the 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 theoretically not possible, but anything is possible. Blessing Roland, a situation you've gone for all tests and the results state that you're okay with women having enough eggs. Mess count is okay. Can pregnancy happen without IVF? Yes, you can get pregnant without IVF. If you've done all the tests and everything is okay, you can get pregnant without IVF. Okay? You've done all the tests. Sperm is okay. Tubes are not blocked. You're volating. You can get pregnant without IVF. IVF is only there for those that they've tried and tried and tried and they, get, and they can't get pregnant. IVF will help you. We have that answer. From Instagram, you had ovarian cyst scan it says that it's gone you feel uncomfortable in your right ovary i suggest you get a repeat scan in two to three weeks time with a different scan person so you can get second opinion that is for you on instagram here can ovulation occur day six or seven of cycle it can occur so don't wait for ovulation to have sex have sex regularly ovulation can occur on day six or seven of your cycle Okay, thank you everyone for joining me today. I really appreciate you. Hope to see you soon again. So if you need information about IVF at ATD Laboratories, all the information is here for you on this video. Watch it over and over again and share with your friends, okay? Thank you. See you soon. I'll see you this weekend. God bless you. Have a wonderful weekend in advance. Bye-bye. And most importantly, I want to say I love you all. Bye-bye.